now healthy living and a wake-up call about something millions of us thought we were supposed to do take calcium supplements. A new study out today in a major medical journal warns that the supplements meant to strengthen our bones could be raising the risk of a heart attack. ABC's medical editor, Dr. Richard Besser, is here on that. So, Rich, yeah. everyone was told at a certain age that they should think about taking calcium supplements. That's right. I mean, calcium supplements are everywhere. From, from one drugstore today, we found 35 different products that all have calcium in them, and that doesn't even include multivitamins, which have calcium. 61% of older women take calcium supplements. And how does it affect their hearts? Well, the concern is that a big dose of calcium will put calcium plaques into your, into your arteries, just as it's putting calcium into your bones. You know, you need calcium for, for healthy bones, but the concern is that supplements may be doing more harm than good. You say big dose of the supplements. Yeah, right. What are we talking about here? Should you take any at all? Well, you know, the concern is if one pill is good for me, two may be better. The number to remember is 2,000 milligrams. That is what is, is too much. You know, that's where you have to start worrying about effects on your kidneys and on your heart. My bottom line, you know, don't get your calcium from pills. You try and get it through what you eat every day. So stay below 2,000 no matter what. That's right. But what do you have to eat to get enough? Well, l let me show you. I mean, it's not as hard as it sounds. Here, <laughs> here is a, a simple look at, at what it takes. Cereal, low-fat milk, orange juice, all fortified with calcium, uh -huh. some almonds. If you take that in, you're done for the day and you're getting it through your food so you don't have to worry that it's going to do any damage to your heart. So that alone will do it. Okay, as yeah. we said, a big wake-up call tonight. Thanks so much.